Hello, hello. How are you? Seven-year-old Alfie Dingley has severe epilepsy. Last year, his mum, Hannah, successfully campaigned for a special licence for him to be granted medicinal cannabis. She says it's stopped him having hundreds of seizures a week and has completely changed their lives. I was dying inside watching my child die in front of me. It was the most horrendous experience I have ever gone through. And I thank God every day that I decided to fight for my son because he's here now because of that. If I hadn't have done that, who knows where he'd be. He wouldn't be here. And I would be a grieving mother of a lost child. And hold it in your mouth. Alfie is now one of only two children in the country to receive medicinal cannabis on the NHS. It follows a decision by the government last year to allow doctors to prescribe the drug for conditions like epilepsy. But today, the health watchdog NICE ruled that medicinal cannabis shouldn't be routinely prescribed. The review found there was a lack of evidence about the long-term safety and effectiveness of medicinal cannabis. And it said there was a clear lack of evidence that these treatments provide any benefits. It went on to recommend that more research be carried out. For, for the NHS to dedicate uh, resources and for these products to be used more widely, we really do need to be sure that the evidence base is strong enough. So what we're not saying is that these should not be used. What we are saying is that for us to make a recommendation they should be used more widely, uh, we do need more research evidence. But Alfie's mum says trials can take years to complete and children with severe epilepsy need medicinal cannabis now. My son is living proof that this works, you know, and it might not be the pharmaceutical evidence that these doctors want, but we need to change our minds then and look and be more modern and look at the way other countries are implementing this and help people, because surely that's the most important thing here is patience. The health watchdog says it shouldn't be routinely handed out. But Alfie's mum says he's been transformed by medicinal cannabis. And she'll keep on fighting to make sure other children can benefit like he has. Leila Hayes, 5 News.